guys, welcome back to my channel. So today, um, I'm uploading an extra video this week because I just got my iPhone 11 Pro Max. I don't even know if that's how it's called. Like, it's kind of confusing now. A 64 gigabyte iPhone 11 Pro Max in the color, what color is it? Base gray or whatever it's called. We're gonna be hotboxing and unboxing this iPhone 11 Pro Max. So stay tuned if you wanna see how the unboxing goes. I haven't watched an unboxing for the iPhone yet, so I'm gonna be watching my own for the first time. So that's the thesis. Yeah, I don't know how the iPhone looks in person. I didn't see it in person. I just saw like pictures of it online and I was like, let me pre-order that bitch. So I pre-ordered her. Um, without any further ado, let's hotbox and unbox the iPhone 11 Pro Max. Since we're doing an unboxing, it's obviously only appropriate to hotbox as well. So I need to find a lighter because I left mine in the car, I believe. Oh my god, excuse a fucking lawnmower outside. So, um, let's fucking hit this blunt. I don't know why I brought a butter knife to, like, unbox this, but apparently I did. But I just realized you don't need a knife to unbox this. Thanks, Apple. It's still sealed. I'm guessing you pull this green tab, obviously. Ooh. Ooh. Now there's no paper wrap. Okay. So, let's open her up. Where the- Oh my god, for a second that looked green. I was like, what the fuck is this? But it looks so nice. Opening this high is even, like, crazier. It's literally matte. So, look. You see? Frosted. It looks frosted first. And- it's glass too, which is the scary part, but it's a nice matte glass, which I've never seen on an iPhone, I think. I don't think they've done that yet. Let me do a little close up. Let me take her out and look at that. This is my new iPhone. That looks so sick. Honestly though, it kind of feels like the same phone. Like I forget I upgraded unless I like turn it around or something. <laughs> oh, we got the phone. We'll open that. We'll like turn her on in a little bit. And now we have the actual stuff inside here. And I know like these chargers are like fast charging. Look how big they are. These shits are like huge. They're like a big brick. And it's actually USB-C, which honestly I'm not mad about because I have a MacBook and yeah, it like only gets USB-C imports. So that's perfect for me because if I want to charge my phone on my like computer, I can and I don't have to buy an extra cable anymore. So that came in clutch. And then there's these AirPods, <laughs> AirPods, there's these ear pods. I don't know what I'm gonna do with them. I'm probably not gonna use them because I have AirPods. So like, you know. Honestly though, I fucking love my AirPods. Like in class, I'm just like, shut the fuck up. So yeah, so then this is the new charger. It's USB-C to this thingy. And it's fast charging, which is like even better because I come back home and like my phone's at 10%. And I do use my phone a lot, not gonna lie. Fucking never charges fast. So this is gonna come in clutch. I know it. Oh my God, it smells like weed. So oh, the actual phone, look at that. But this is my new iPhone. Holy shit. It feels like way nicer too. It just feels, it just like slips. But that's might be a good thing. I mean, that might be a bad thing because it literally feels like I, it could like just slip off my hand, but I'm gonna make sure to protect this bitch because I'm sure it's gonna be like really expensive to repair, so I'm not down for that. Now that I have the new iPhone, I'm like, this looks odd. Like, this one camera does not look right. I feel like this is like what looks correct. Like, it's all proportioned, like it's fucking cute. And I'm gonna turn her on, I'm, that's what she said. Oh, it's on now. Oh my God, it just said hello to me. I'm gonna have to set this up and like do all that bullshit. So it's activating my iPhone, thank God. I also heard the face ID on this was like, um, 30% faster, so, I don't know if I'm even gonna notice that, but we'll see. Love it, it fits perfectly. And it is the Pro Max, so it is a little bigger, but honestly, I think it looks like super normal. It is finally set up after like a fucking hour. But this is the new iPhone, but I'm really excited to see the uh, new features, which are, I forgot, like that's how many it doesn't have. So that's really cool. The camera does, does zoom out a lot. It kind of looks like a fish eye. 
No way. That's that one. <gasps> I love how my selfies look on this. Oh my god. It's not as like zoomed in as my other iPhone was, where, like where I would take a picture here and like you could see my fucking double chin because it was like this zoom it zoomed in. This is way more far out, which I fucking like. Sounds like the audio is in the middle rather than on the bottom of my phone, which is kind of cool. Now I can hear it all throughout my phone, which is like way better. It's kind of heavier, but I don't really care. Oh my god, I fucking love the audio on this. Honestly, it does come in clutch, not gonna lie. Sorry, I'm just here like choosing a new screensaver. Give me a second. A new wallpaper. That's it for today's video. Thanks so much for unboxing my iPhone with me. Make sure to follow all my other social medias, which are Leo Romero J, if you want to keep up with my life. Make sure to subscribe and like and comment down below any video ideas you guys want to see. I'll see you guys next time. Have a wonderful day and peace. I just bought a ride and I switched lines. I just like water.